Hey, so I'm going to talk about authenticity. And I want to start by saying who you are is a vibe. It's like a, a vibe. There is a feeling to who you are. So when you introspect and you look at yourself very deeply and you understand who you are, um, you know, as you grow older and stuff, you recognize that um, you you begin to understand your personality better. Okay, but there is something about you that is completely different from everyone else, and you can't explain what that is in words okay because everybody has a very unique um i i only word i can think of is a vibe okay so in this world unfortunately especially in the west is we're taught to be phony if it if it benefits other people so like for example um well if we think it benefits other people like for example um if you're having small talk and you're you know hi how are you blah blah, blah. how's the weather blah, blah blah and we end up having these conversations that are so phony and really the point is to have a smooth discussion and make the other person smile or something. But what ends up happening is that because of this phony interaction, um, a true bond is not able to form. I believe that uh, a true bond can really only form between two 100% authentic people, 100%. Because if you're always hiding behind a phony uh, persona, then what ends up happening is the people you talk to end up getting to know a character that is a version of yourself and that character is partially sincere and partially false to varying levels so the problem is the reason why I say 100% you need to be 100% authentic to to form a bond is because the person that you're forming a bond with, they have to see you for you. They have to see you for who you are. Now, for a long time, from my whole life, basically, until I, I realized that I was doing this, uh, which was really only a few days ago, um, is I, I would be a chameleon with people. Not ill-intentioned. It was well-intentioned. I wanted to make people happy, right? So, I, uh, I would say things to people that would make them happy. Um, not lie or anything, but I would just act in a way that I knew they would laugh at. Because a lot of people like comedy rather than like the, like the, deep stuff that I talk about here, most people don't aren't interested in that. So I would so with people so with other some people I just talk I just talk in a more comedic way. Okay? Because that's what I learned to do to fit in more. But the thing is um I would say things in a certain ways and mirror people and, and do things that I thought would make people happy. And 
I was that that well intention to wanting to make people happy was the exact thing that was blocking me from forming true bonds with people because I knew that they didn't know me really that they didn't really know me okay um, they knew a version of me that I created for them but they didn't know me and the, the thing is I didn't know me fully you know because I'm always being something different for somebody else so um, I didn't know my vibe which is what I was saying at the beginning of the video so basically when you find your vibe when you find that feeling that energy that encompasses your personality your true self and you you know what it is what that feeling is and what that self is you can you can enhance it by being yourself more because a lot of times we're we're stopping ourselves from being ourselves because we either want to please somebody or we don't want to hurt somebody or we um we're trying to hide something or or people don't accept us if we're expressing ourselves authentically sometimes. But when you know your vibe, you can be it much more authentically and you can be yourself more. You can be yourself to a larger degree and that feet like your soul when you do that your soul makes you feel good really because you you feel so good when you're doing it because you're in harmony with who you really are so you have harmony and it just feels comfortable and your body you when you use the body language that really comes naturally to you when you use the the voice inflections as that really comes naturally to you and you stop trying to please people with with things that you think that they might want or they might respond to and you just be yourself finally then you can you can see the beauty in it you can see the beauty in it a lot I think a lot of the reason we don't see the beauty in ourselves is because we hide ourselves from ourselves sometimes because we're so used to being something for whether it's a job and hi how you doing you know how everybody <laughs> customer service like we're 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 convinced to be phony so much in this society that sometimes it can be hard to even recognize who you are. So, so, but when you find your vibe and you find who you really are, it's precious. It's really precious. And you're just like, oh, yeah this is me this is this is who I am and this is the feeling of who I am and I never want to let it go and I don't want to have to be something else for somebody else you know I just want to be me all right I guess that's it for now see ya